first and foremost, I think obviously as we move into 2021, we've, uh, we're coming into a post-Brexit world and hopefully uh, post-Covid world. And with that, most organisations over the last year would have been looking at how they adapt to those environments um, uh, and ultimately how they evolve into the new markets um, and economical situations that we find ourselves in. Um, I think one of the other main challenges is that over the last year or more now, um, the whole country's had to embrace different ways of working, establish new working patterns, new working models, um, and within that new staffing structures, onboarding processes and things like that. Now, hopefully over the next few months, um, we will be seeing some form of return to normality. So I think one of the challenges um, that our industry will be facing both internally and externally will be around those working practices and those working patterns. We are going to see some shifts back towards um, office working. Um, so really we need to look at you know, what lessons we learned over the last year, what are the good things that we can take out of those working from home practices, those onboarding processes that we've seen, uh, virtual meetings um, and, and all that good stuff. Uh, and also analyse what life was like and what working life was like pre-COVID and try and extract the good things um, from those working patterns in the hope that we can merge them together. And I do think that recruitment organisations um, will on one hand be looking at those issues for ourselves, uh, but obviously we'll be looking at how we can establish and build solutions to help our client base um, on board, retain and attract um, new talent with that in the background.